And JT, but the question I'm going to, I'm just going to check with you. Yeah. What you made of the big weekend. And I think it's just me who remembers television. I think television has gone. And it wasn't such a news event as I made it out to be. A lot of people have stopped watching. Television has gone. Where's it gone to? Well, there's people watching it. <laughs> it's not going to happen overnight, is it? No. No, we'll have to make our own television soon. Ah, oh, well, we could do that. Yeah, we could do that, no problem. It's not w that... Would they like to see the life of how we get on down at the studio? Um, First thing, cool. Well. <laughs> <laughs> I'm exhausted, I not Yes, <laughs> <laughs> yes we've, had, we've had sort of half an hour of um, sorting ourselves out. <laughs> I think it's fair enough to explain to our long-suffering audience that <laughs> after... <laughs> After what appeared to be silence, yeah, but was actually an installation of some kind. Yes, it was. There was then. It was um, us. We disappeared to the coffee shop for an hour. But, yeah, but we should have left the robot. Well, the, the robot was going. It was going. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but anyway, no, seriously, because last time we spoke, you mm. were trying to explain to me that you watch music now on your tablet. I do. And finding the iPlayer or YouTube is yeah. natural to you. Absolutely natural now. It, it wasn't a few years ago, but now it is. Now it is. Now, yes, I've grown into it. So an event such as the big weekend, Radio 1, yeah. the fact that's hardly on television, yeah. and to the extent it is on television, people on ra around Radio 1 don't seem to want to mention it. Or it's not important to them, let's say. Well, it, I, can see, I, I read that um, a lot of people left at least... 20, 25 minutes before while Coldplay was playing. And the reason is because it's already online, so they don't really need to see the rest of it. So what, they, they, got left the, they left the live performance? Yes, they did, yes. Because because of the traffic, uh, it, takes, it took about three or four hours to get out or something. <laughs> right. So they, they went through Coldplay, and then they... Well, they, they're not stupid. They know it's on our player. <laughs> they don't need to... But, look. but last week we were saying it's not the same. Not the the, same. There's something about a live performance. Well, I suppose there's something about being stuck in traffic for four hours as well. Yes, <laughs> true. <laughs> yeah. And then, and also, well, I, I, doing a live programme is better, in the way. Doing a live programme or watching yeah. a live performance? I would like to stress, this, this programme's not live. <laughs> <laughs> no. No, we couldn't, we couldn't have scripted it, though, could we? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, we get we get we get the script editors on it straight <laughs> <Turn> away. <laughs> anyway, Jody, I'm sorry, I interrupted you. What what, mm. were you. what were you about to say? I was about to say what about about live live, live music. Live music. I mean, I forget well, live radio. That's all faked anyway. I've but, been to one or two bands. Mm. About say say two. <laughs> yep, yep. One or two. There you go. I told you two. Um, but I I went because I wanted to see what they that group was like live. Yeah, I don't need to go and see it again. Well, are you sure about that? Because they might develop. They might. Well, they've been I mean, around. The, the, so, so, the are we, been around are we thinking mean, about level forty-two, for example? Yes. Well, that's why I've been seen twice. Well, well you see, well, I wouldn't actually go and pay to go again. Well, Once I've been, uh, I've been. That's my experience done. Yeah, but I mean, a group that's a group that's constantly changing. Like the Rolling Stones, for example. They, they might come up with something completely different the next time you go to see them. What? A, a, a song? Yeah, they might have <laughs> one new song. <laughs> <laughs> Only one. <laughs> well, well, I don't know. No, perhaps, perhaps two or three. Two or three. Yeah. Well, I haven't seen the Rolling Stones, so if I would go and see somebody I haven't seen, I don't need to go back and see the same person over well, and over again. Well, perhaps you'd go... Would you go and see Bob Dylan? And you, you'd have a whole evening of Sinatra songs. Is he songs. still around? Yeah, he's, he's, <laughs> he's definitely still around. He's got a new CD out. Oh, has he? Well, he, right. I don't think he's done a tour exactly promoting that, that style. But well, that would be well, interesting, wouldn't it? I haven't heard his music now, so I can't actually comment on it. Oh, right. So, basically, Joe, do you, you're listening to 80s bands... Yes. And you, they are pretty much as you remember them. Yes. And you're quite happy with that. But I have, today, on the way in, in my car, I decided not to listen to any radio stations or anything like that. Mm. I put on my trusty old um, C CSB <laughs> stick. Yes. And uh, I played mixes. Mixes. So they're from people who are probably younger than I am, slightly. Yes, yes. <laughs> it, is, it is possible. And it is possible to, to actually... 
do mixes from the 80s yes and jazz them up ah and i've heard jazzed up song of the songs and uh, some of them are quite you know <laughs> but some of them are pretty good so you know it depends really yeah well that's the sort of thing I, i'm gonna play i will play some music in a little bit but what, what i'd like to talk about even now or later or as we go along mm -hmm. it just seems to me that's what's sort of missing because i my, my impression is that all the, all the radio one people and the people who listen to radio one were quite happy with the idea of the the visual or visual radio, I think they call it, mm -hmm. uh, because they've got a channel on the iPlayer, and so it's not television exactly. They call it visual radio, but on an occasion like the big weekend, the the, the number of cameras and the editing budget and everything, it's pretty much video or television, whatever you want to call it. Anyway, pe pe people just seem to be adjusted to that, and I think Mumford and Sons and Coldplay on BBC Four was just an extra different. A different audience where it happened to fit in reasonably well um, but what I think is BBC four could do more remixes as you put it so it probably is watched during the week by people who are interested in history and country houses and traveling around and so forth and possibly an older audience than most BBC audiences and yes they want to watch top of the pops in the 1980s but if they were offered a remix of some sort, or some sort of connection with whatever's going on at the moment, it, it, it wouldn't be terrible, I don't think. Anyway, um, I was. Do you, do you want to comment? You, you're having to think about that. I'm, I'm, my brain is working overtime here. If you if you know now what I've just done five seconds ago, <laughs> and a quick bop bop in the studio as well. Yes. Just trying to get my brain rounded. Okay. Well, yeah. I'm going to. Uh, shall I play some music while yeah. we while I'll we think about what we what we really think about this? So we're sticking with um, 